What is up guys, Everything Flash here. The CW has just revealed new details about this year's annual DC TV crossover between Arrow, Flash, DC's Legends of Tomorrow, and Supergirl. The 2017 crossover is said to be titled Crisis on Earth X. The crossover was revealed with new key art by Phil Jimenez, done in the style of the classic Silver Age DC crossovers between different Earths. This version of the comic book story is actually going to be a little different than the one they are going to do on TV. The main synopsis for this episode is that with all the heroes in town to celebrate Barry and Iris' wedding, villains from Earth-X crash the festivities with a deadly agenda. The premise is that Barry and Iris' long-awaited wedding pulls together all their friends, including ones from different Earths such as Supergirls. But it'll be crashed by evil versions of Kara, Oliver, and Barry from Earth-X. To make it worse, they're actually evil Nazi versions of the characters too, so we'll have to see how that plays out. Not only do the evil versions of the heroes look awesome, especially the Supergirl costume, the poster confirms that the event will see the live action debut of The Ray, who the CW is currently turning into an animated star for both the DC cartoon and the CW. It has also been confirmed that the British actor Russell Tovey will play Raymond the Ray Terrell in both the CW cartoon and the live action for the crossover. For those of you not familiar with who he is, Raymond Terrell was a reporter who discovered a group of government scientists working on a secret project to turn light into a weapon of mass destruction. But before he could report his findings, the project had exposed Ray to a genetic light bomb. The bomb failed to kill him and instead gifted Ray with light-based powers. With these abilities, Ray realized he could do more than just report on injustices. He could actually take action. Calling himself the Ray, he was recruited by Uncle Sam and the Freedom Fighters on Earth-X to fight violence and oppression wherever it existed. Given that he's fighting Nazi versions of Barry, Ollie, and Kara, it makes sense for him to make his live-action debut here, during the four-way crossover. We'll have to wait and see if any news about this four-way crossover will drop in the next month or so. Make sure to enable the notifications button to not miss out on the latest Flash and Arrowverse news. As usual guys, if you like this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks.